Hello guys and welcome back to the Media Nights. My name is Ari. And I'm Denise. And today we're going to be watching the movie Troy. It came out in 2004. And this is a movie that a lot of you guys suggested in Gladiator. That was a spectacular film. So I'm super excited to watch another epic. I mean, you know, Brad Pitt is in this. Eric Bana. For sure, there's going to be some amazing performances in this film. Have been hearing mm -hmm. lots of it. We're going to be watching the director's cut, by the way. So it's a little bit longer. I've heard that that's the better cut. So I trust you guys. And I honestly cannot wait to see what they do with this. One of the ways that we actually heard about the director Wolfgang Petersen is uh, we got recommendations for uh, Dust Bolt. We are absolutely going to do that one. We're super excited for that one. This is just us doing a little bit of homework mm -hmm. <laughs> beforehand. If you guys want to catch the full length reaction, that's going to be available on our Patreon. It's going to be a watch along format, so you do need your own copy. And if you want to watch these reactions early, make sure that you hit the join button and become a YouTube member. Thank you guys so much for all of your support, and we'll catch you guys after the movie. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> Fragile mm. Alliance. Oh boy. <laughs> it's going to be juicy. Wow. It's interesting to see, right? Almost like through the perspective of innocence. Will strangers hear our names and wonder who we were, how bravely we fought, how fiercely we loved? They certainly remembered. Yep, we know the names. Yeah. It's crazy how the history echoes through centuries and centuries. Yeah. Wow, the costume wow. design for this must have been insane. <laughs> look at how many of them there are. Yeah, look at how many extras. Wow. Very nice. Wow. Good day for the crows. Remove your army from my land. I like your land. I like your soldiers too. Oh boy. <laughs> they won't fight for you. That's what the Mycenaeans said. And the Arcadians. And the Apeans. Oh wow. Oh man. They all fight for me. Oh, he's cocky, huh? Yeah. <laughs> It's too big, even for you. <laughs> He's just cackling. Your best fighter against my best. And if my man wins, we'll leave Thessaly for good. Boagrius! <laughs> he was like, done deal, man. Jeez, your He's... man better be good. Yeah, he seems pretty confident. <laughs> oh, that's oh. why. <laughs> he is massive. God damn. Looking like Kratos. <laughs> yes, actually. Achilles! Uh, Achilles. Oh boy. He was not impressed too. He was like, that's all you got? All right. Yeah. Boagrius has this effect on many heroes. <laughs> Careful who you insult, old king. Achilles is not with the army. Where is he? I sent a boy to look for him. Where the hell is he? <laughs> <Where> the <laughs> He's not with the army. <laughs> he just didn't show up for battle. He's like, eh, not today. He slept in. I slept in. <laughs> ah, got it. <laughs> mm. Took care of business first. Yes, he had priorities. He fought his own battles. <laughs> he fought his own battles. Agamemnon sent me. He I'll needs to- I'll speak to your king in the morning. My lord, mm. it is morning. They're waiting for you. Oh my god, can you imagine? They're waiting. They're waiting to start their battle because of you. Showing up fashionably late to the party. They say your mother is an immortal goddess. They say you can't mm. be killed. I wouldn't be bothering with the shield then, would I? <laughs> I wouldn't want to fight him. That's why no one will remember your name. That's a little mean. <laughs> Poor well, kid. Gotta be brave, right? But I mean, come on, that, that dude is intimidating as hell. Yes. Gonna have to use some strategy here, man. Mm hmm I should have you whipped for your impudence. Perhaps you should fight him. Achilles. Achilles. I like him. You can save hundreds of them. Think how many songs they'll sing in your honor. Let them go home to their wives. That manipulation, though. But all of that is on him. The yeah. amount of pressure, too, you would feel. Imagine a king who fights his own battles. Wouldn't that be a psych? <laughs> That's so facts. That's so true. Of all the warlords loved by the gods, I hate him the most. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you I need do. him, my king. For now. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, he's a bit, he has a bit of that rebellious side in him. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ooh, Ooh very Sheesh. nice. Oh, that's the shield. Ooh, He did not bother with nice. the shield. No. Oh! Oh! Ow, 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 ow. oh. Ah. One move?
I mean, come Damn. on. Guy's good at what he does. The ruler of Thessaly carries this scepter. Give it to your king. He's not my king. Hmm. Right, because they're being forced to fight for him. That's very interesting. So he clearly has a lot of resentment towards Agamemnon. Princes of Troy, on our last night together, Queen Helen and I salute you. Hey, there they are. <laughs> Priam is a good king, good man. I respected him as an adversary. I respect him now as my ally. He needs to stop staring at <laughs> his wife that much. To peace between Troy and Sparta. May the gods keep the wolves in the hills and the women in our beds. Hey, <laughs> cheers, man. <laughs> Sounds like a pretty good deal. No wolves? Yes. Yep. Wow, look at those costumes. That's amazing. I love the armors, too, that the princes were wearing. Yeah. Such beautiful armors. So much detail, too. Only one man wields a sword better than you. Achilles. That madman. Mmm. See that one over there? I picked especially for you. Oh, wow. Cherry picked. Oh. Thank you. My wife waits for me in Troy. Aww. My wife waits for me right there. Wives are for breeding. You understand? For making little princes. Come enjoy yourself tonight. You make excellent wine in Sparta. He's like, let's just change the subject, man. Let's agree to disagree. She does not seem happy at all. No. Seems miserable. Boy. <laughs> He's gonna be like, oh, uh, don't huh. get yourself in trouble, man. I don't know, that seems like a really risky thing to do, man. Like, y'all just made peace. <laughs> you shouldn't be here. That's what you said last night. Oh! Oh! It's happened already. And the night before. Multiple, Multiple times. times. <laughs> Mistakes this week. He's like, what's one more mistake? You know, come on. <laughs> it's one more mistake. It's fine. You want me to go? Yes. I'm getting some mixed signals here. You can't do that. Come I mean, on. <laughs> They're going to get in so much trouble, man. This is going to be so bad. I have a really... I have a sinking feeling about this. The king's wife. Out of all the ladies you could have chosen. I know. Out of and there, clearly there's plenty. <laughs> he knows. He knows what the, what his brother is up to. I'm not afraid of dying. I'm afraid of tomorrow. I'm afraid of watching you sail away and knowing you'll never come back. Aww. Aww. She's stuck in a horrible situation. Come with me. No. Don't do that. If you come, it seems so vulnerable. We'll never be safe. Men will hunt us. The gods will curse us. I love you. Oh, yeah. They're actually in love. It's yeah. not what she has with the king. Yeah, clearly that was probably just more of a trade situation, right? Yeah, it's she like was forced into it. Goat or pig? Which does the sea god prefer? <laughs> <laughs> I'll wake the priest and ask him. Make sure. Yeah. What does he want today? <laughs> So busted, dude. I have a word with you. I have no trouble sleeping on the seas, brother. The sea names sing lullabies to me. And who sang lullabies to you tonight? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. If you do anything to endanger Troy, I will rip your pretty face from your pretty skull. Yeah, he means it. Yeah. It's for the good, the good of the people, man. I understand, though. Like, find love somewhere else. <laughs> it's not a wise decision to make. No, not at all. Because it's not just about Menelaus, right? His brother, obviously, is so powerful. You piss off one, you piss off, obviously, the entire Greek forces. There goes your peace. Yeah. That's it. Peace that clearly they've been fighting so hard to, yeah. to get to, right? Do you love me, brother? Would you protect me against any enemy? Oh, my God. The last time you spoke to me like this, you were 10 years old and you'd just stolen father's horse. What did you do? What have you done now? Oh, no. Don't tell me. Don't oh, tell me! No. Don't tell me! Don't tell me he is this stupid! He brought her with. Oh, they are so There's dead. There's no fucking way they're that dumb. Oh, man. God 
young and in love. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she, As oh, an older she, sibling myself, I know that look damn well. I'm like, yeah. what have you done? Wait, wait, you fool. Listen to me. Do you know what you've done? Seriously. I love her. <sighs> what about your father's love? You spat on him when you brought her on this ship. Damn. What about the love for your country? You'd let Troy burn for this woman? The dialogue, Jesus. That's fantastically written. Wow. They'll kill you. <laughs> then I'll die fighting. Have you ever killed a man? No. Ever seen a man die in combat? Aww. You say you want to die for love, but you know nothing about dying, and you know nothing about love. He's too immature. Yeah, he's and very inexperienced. Nice. The Troy! Out ship! Set sail! Damn. This is such an engaging way to revisit history. <laughs> yeah. This is great. <laughs> Some of the details that we might have forgotten. That's crazy though, so he's not- he's continuing on to Troy. I should have listened to you. Peace is for the women and the weak. Empires are forged by war. Oh wow, now both of their goals are aligned. Mm-hmm. An insult to me is an insult to you. And an insult to me is an insult to all Greeks. That's a great there. way to escalate the whole situation. This is all he wanted all along. I want all the kings of Greece! And the armies send emissaries in the morning. One last thing. We need Achilles and his Myrmidons. Yeah, you need the best of the best. <laughs> he hates him. He's like that <laughs> asshole. Achilles is the past. A man who fights for no flag. A man loyal to no country. How many battles have we won off the edge of his sword? Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. You still need him. He's going to have to put his pride aside. Mm-hmm. Nervous? <laughs> Petrified. <laughs> Very <Petrified>. nice. <laughs> I mean, never to change sword hands. I love the rhythm of the camera work here. Yes. You know how to use it. You won't be taking my orders. The choice of keeping it one shot and then cutting to their shot whenever mm -hmm. they speak. Are you here at Agamemnon's bidding? Mm hmm. About that. Gotta talk to you. Trojans never harm me. They insulted Greece. They insulted one Greek. A man who couldn't hold on to his wife. What business is that of mine? That's amazing. The man has no honor. I won't be remembered as a tyrant's mercenary. Mm hmm Let Agamemnon fight for power and let the gods decide which man to glorify. That's an amazing line. That's so good. Prince Hector's he's good a warrior, as they say. The best of all the Trojans. Some say he's better than all the Greeks, too. <laughs> <laughs> I see what you're doing. We could use a strong arm like yours. Play your tricks on me, but not my cousin. <laughs> but I have my tricks. We play with the toys that God give us. True. Indeed we do. Oh, what an interest interesting shot. Yeah. Never be forgotten. Nor will the heroes who fight in it. Oh, that reached him. Mm -hmm. First of all, that competitiveness. Wait, you say he's the best of the best? And then, of course, he wants to be remembered by something that he believes in, right? He doesn't want to be just a mercenary. If you go to Troy, glory will be yours. They will write stories about your victories. You will never come home. Mm. For your glory walks hand in hand with your doom. Wow. Oh, no. It's a big price to pay for glory. Well, that's where the decision comes in, right? Do you choose peace or glory? Well, clearly he looks up to being someone, right? Yeah. Wow. Dude, look at that fleet. He wasn't lying. The largest. Went all the way to the horizon, yo. Can you imagine you see that arriving <laughs> at your doorstep? I'll be like, <laughs> uh, nope. Can we talk about this for a second, guys? I know you're Just all quick. Quick pause. How the hell did they did they build this? This is incredible. This had to have a huge budget. <laughs> I cannot imagine. Like, is that her? There's yeah, no way that's her. I think her. that was it, right? Is that, wait, is that? Is that yes, her? they are that dumb. <laughs> they did this. <laughs> I wonder how the father's going to take it. I mean, if I were the father, I'd be pretty pissed. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? Yeah. That's my effort gone. This is Helen. Helen of Sparta? Helen of Troy. Yeah. I've heard rumors of your beauty. For once, the gossips were right. Welcome. Oh, he's super polite. Yeah, he's very, very oh. kind. It's for your safe return. For the gods. For the gods. Wow, what a warm welcome. They really made this feel like home. The love in the father's eyes, too, when he sees his two boys, you know? It's like mm. pride and happiness to see them again. Yeah, like he welcomes them as their father, not their king. What would you have me do? Yeah, what can you do now? 
If we send her home to men allow us, he will follow her. This is my country. I don't want to see them suffer so my brother can have his prize. Yeah, he cares for the people. Yes. Apollo watches over us. And how many battalions does the sun god command? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the father has all his faith in the gods. Yeah, and he's trying to approach things logically. They're coming for me. I can only imagine the terror. Imagine you just you just keep looking at the horizon waiting for the ships to pull up. What if we went down to the stables, took two horses and left? I could hunt deer, rabbit, I could feed us. He's in love, but he's naive. Yes, he really is. And Elaz won't give up. He'll track us to the end of the world. Yeah, yeah. he will never give up. I love the dialogue and how much depth it has. Also, the actors are carrying, you know, th these scenes in such an amazing way. They, they're they not overperforming. They just know exactly how to be able to stay natural. Yeah, which can be difficult, right? When it's like when you speak English the way you do in movies like these, right. it's very easy to kind of sound either fake or overly dramatic. Yes, in a way. yes. But no, they play it just right. Is that not the doctor chick in Deep Blue Sea? What was her character's name? Susan? Oh no. Is that it? Oh, ho, ho. Holy crap. Wow. The scale of this is incredible. They did a phenomenal job at showing just how massive these battles were. Yeah. <laughs> He's in this too? That's awesome. But Agamemnon's orders. Fight for me, Eudorus, or Agamemnon. For you, my lord. Let the servants of Agamemnon fight for him. Mm. Yeah, fuck Agamemnon. I love how he's always going against the grain. He's like, <laughs> I love they it. will never fully control me. I'll fight, yeah, no. but on my own terms. Put down your spear. But I'm fighting the Trojans, cousin. Not today. I can't fight the Trojans. I'm concerned for you. Hmm. Well, he's Achilles' responsibility now, right? I feel like it was a mistake to bring him on, though. I feel like this is gonna bite us in the ass later. I've lived by a code, and the code is simple. Honor the gods, love your woman, and defend your country. That's a pretty good code. Fight wow. for your land, man. Yeah, everybody's just rushing in. Yeah. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's a great shot. Do you know what's there? Waiting. Beyond that beach, immortality! Take it! It's yours! Time to make history. Well, he sure knows how to rile them up. Yeah, that was a good speech. Shit, I'm fired up. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> how are they gonna beat right. this guy? He's... Oof. Oh. Hey, forward! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Lost a lot already, man. Yeah, they're showing us why the bow and arrow was so effective back in the day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Damn, this guy's got a great Damn, aim. Damn, headshot. He's so fast. I don't even know who to root for, man, because I get why they're pissed, but um, I feel so bad for... I'm so conflicted. feel bad for the Trojans. Yeah. This really was not their fight. Oh, oh wow! Oh, 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 oh. Got so lucky. Lucky or smart? Oh, oh my god. god! There goes his leg. I'm actually loving the gore on this. Sun God is a patron of Troy. Take whatever treasure you can find. They won the first fight. Yeah. First come, first serve, right? Speak. Apollo sees everything. Perhaps it is not wise to offend him. You recognize that actor, right? Whoa. <laughs> he offended. Damn. If there is a god, you just pissed him off. Yeah. <laughs> pretty sure that's in the blasphemy territory, yeah, no? <laughs> yeah. I think it gets pretty close. I feel like to be safe, you probably shouldn't. Wait. Oh, he's about to do some shit. Yeah. Not a throw. Oh. 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 The audacity! <laughs> How dare you! Why kill you now, Prince of Troy? With no one here to see you fall. <gasps> oh! Yo! Oh man, my blood would be boiling. <laughs> Go home, Prince. Drink some wine, make love to your wife. Tomorrow we'll have our war. Wow. Speak of war as if it's a game. 
<laughs> but how many wives wait at Troy's gates for husbands I'll never see again? Perhaps your brother can comfort them. I hear he's good at charming other men's wives. Oh! Oh my god! What a burn. Man, Sorry. he's not wrong. That was a mic drop, or a sword drop in this case. <laughs> Damn, he roasted the let him shit go? out of him. It's too early in the day for killing princes. <laughs> Interesting, he really wants that honor? They fight for very different reasons, right? The stakes to him are only personal, it's for his own glory. I'm honored to go to war with you. As am I. If you sailed any slower, the war would be over. I'm missing a start, <laughs> as long as I'm here at the end. <laughs> I've got see? something to show you. Oh, that's great. I love this. One take and you just see the people coming by and... Yeah. What's your name? We killed Apollo's priests. Sun God will have his vengeance. What are you waiting for? <laughs> yeah. You're royalty, aren't you? You must be royalty. <laughs> Damn. He just knows. You don't need to fear me, girl. You're the only Trojan who can say that. Wow. Wow. I like that there is a sense of honor in him, too. He wants nothing to do with her either, so yeah. there's a sense of doing the right thing. There's layers to him. Like, he's he's complex. He's hard to figure out fully. Mm -hmm. In honor of an even more memorable victory. Thank you, old friend. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently you won some great victory. Ah, perhaps you didn't notice. <laughs> a great victory was won today. But that victory is not yours. Kings did not pay homage to Achilles. Perhaps the kings were too far behind to see. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes. You want gold? Take it. It's my gift to honor your courage. <laughs> of course. Of course he would. This fucking piece of shit. I hate him so much. If you don't release her, you'll never see home again. Decide. Yes! Oh, he's going to put his oh, life on the line for her. Wow. Too many people have died today. Killing's your only talent. That's your curse. I don't want anyone dying for me. Wow. Mighty Achilles silenced by a slave girl. I would chop off his head at where he stood right now. Before my time is done, I will look down on your corpse and smile. Yes, I want to see that happen, please. I love how brave he is speaking to the king like that. Mm -hmm. They saw an eagle flying with a serpent clutched in his talons. We will win a great victory tomorrow. Bird signs. Great. <laughs> He's a believer, but Hector's like, no, nah, man. No, you, you need people. You need soldiers. But today I fought a Greek who desecrated the statue of Apollo. Apollo didn't strike the man down. Right. The gods won't fight this war for us. Thank you. Exactly. There won't be a war. What are you going to do about it? Here we go again. Tomorrow morning, I will challenge Menelaus for the right to Helen. Oh, the boy. winner will take her home. Loser will burn before nightfall. I know. Yeah, I know uh, where this is going. This is not yeah. going to end well. Paris, that's your doom, man. Like, I don't he know. He hasn't seen battle at all. No. Not like his brother. And I don't know how much training he has. My father carried this sword and his father before him. The history of our people was written with this sword. Sword of Troy. What a huge honor. May I give you luck, man. I feel like he's gonna need it. Wait! What the hell was that? Let me go! <laughs> she was gonna give herself. I think so, right? I'm giving myself back to Menelaus. Kill me, make me his slave, I don't care. Anything is better than this. Mm, she feels guilty yeah. for all that loss. Paris is going to fight in the morning. Menelaus will kill him. You're a princess of Troy now. Mm. My brother needs you tonight. Wow, the love he must have for his brother. Like, I don't know if I could forgive him, man. Putting my own family at risk. Mm -hmm. Some mistakes are really hard to get past because, like, it's not just personal. It's about an entire country. Right. The army's marching. Let them march. We stay. <laughs> but the men are ready. We stay till Agamemnon groans to have Achilles back. Yep. As you wish. Yep, good luck convincing him now. Yeah, I would do the same. I would be so freaking petty. We men are wretched things. Soldiers, they fight for kings they've never even met. Soldiers obey. Don't waste your life following some fool's orders. <laughs> Follow your heart. Wow. I love the introspect that these characters are able to to do. Like, they are able to look inside and, yeah. and tell us why they do what they do or why they shouldn't do. It's so interesting because the way he phrases it, though he's a soldier, he... 
it makes it so clear how nonsensical war really is and always has been. He just right? happens to be good at it. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, it's such a mesmerizing character. I started this war. Oh, Paris. Helen, sit with me. She has some great in-laws. <laughs> yeah, they really do like her. <laughs> Doing all of this for you, man. How do you stay still, right? When you see this approaching you, how do you stay calm? Man, this is phenomenal. Just you feel the stakes rising and rising and you're just seeing the numbers like look at this. How are you guys gonna- They're yeah, really gonna have to rely on those- on those uh, archers. Yeah. They'll charge you. Keep your distance and use your speed. You don't have to do this. He's so scared and you can see it. You can see how much of a boy he is. What son of a king would accept a man's hospitality? Embrace him in friendship and then steal his wife in the middle of the night? <sighs> the sun was shining when your wife left you. Oh! <laughs> You can still save Troy, young prince. I have two wishes. No more of your people need die. Oh, that's tempting. Yeah. Helen, back to my brother. Second, mm -hmm. Troy must submit to my command. Ah, of there, course. There's the fine print. I see 50,000 men brought here to fight for one man's greed. Facts. <laughs> and he's not wrong. My mercy has limits. And I've seen the limits of your mercy. And I tell you now, no son of Troy will ever submit to a foreign ruler. Then every son of Troy shall die. So satisfying, though. It is so satisfying. Let us fight our own battle. The winner takes Helen home. A brave offer, but not enough. Because that's not what he wants. It was no. never about her. No. Let me kill this little peacock. I didn't come here for your pretty wife. I came here for Troy. Right. There it is. When he's lying in the dust, give the signal to attack. You'll have your city. I love my revenge. Please, Paris, beat the shit out of him. Yeah. That would be so satisfying. No honor in these men. I accept your challenge, and tonight I'll drink to your bones. <sighs> that look Hector just gave him, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm mildly concerned. Make him swing and miss, he'll tire. There you go. I love that they showed us how brave Hector is too. He yeah. was not intimidated whatsoever. No. Like I see your men, but not impressed. The silence is fantastic, dude. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Ah. Make him regret that decision. Oh. Ah. Okay, okay. Jeez. Let him swing. Okay. Let him swing yeah, and get yeah. tired. Ah. Ah. He really ah. is like a bull. Oh, fuck. Get your shit together. <laughs> for your shield. <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> Oof. Okay, you got one Lincoln. That's good. He still got his helmet on though. <laughs> oh, oh shit. Get up, man. See the crows. Never tasted Prince before. He he's losing this badly, man. Oh, Paris. That's it. Is this what you left me for? Fight me! Oh no. Oh no. That's oh. Fight! Fight him, son. Fight! Fight him. He's just a scared boy. Yeah. The fight is over. The fight is not over. It is now. I'll kill him at your feet, I don't care. He's my brother. He's not gonna allow it. <laughs> oh! Oh, there. Damn, he went there. I mean, it's his brother. I would have done the same thing. Yeah. That just, oh, that's yeah, bad. that doomed. They're doomed. That's it. Like, they were doomed to begin with, but now it's just... No, it's solidified. There's yeah, no way, there's no going back from that decision. sealed their fate, no. Oh, Hector. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, wow. Jeez. Oh, man. this is incredible, man. Paris! 
What the hell what is the he hell? doing? Oh, he's getting the sword. Oh, the sword. The sword, sword of Troy. I feel like Hector deserves that sword. He should be fighting with yeah. the sword right now. Oh, oh the clash. Here it comes. Oh, <laughs> oh dude, this is great. Look at that shot. What a <laughs> what an amazing shot. Wow. Yeah, get them from range. I mean. There you go. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I love how they show just how deadly these were at the time. Yeah. Oh, oh. shit, shit. Come on. Ooh. Damn, yeah. Any one of those swings seemed like it could just take his head off. Yes. It would crush his skull. <gasps> oh. Oh. Come on, man. Come on. Ooh. Nice. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Oh. What a close call, man. Yeah. Oh. oh. He got him. Oof. Oh, wow. He's oh, still dude. standing? <laughs> That's so badass, though. <laughs> yeah. Guy's a freaking tank. He really is. That's number two. Come on, Come on you're still no, fighting? Still Holy shit. I'm still not done. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good fight. Fair and square. I love the thing you look back at Achilles. He's like, you see that? Did you see that, dude? <laughs> Fight! Damn. Pushing them back. They're using the wall as a defense. <laughs> wow. Damn. Okay, okay, the Trojans are pushing back. They're holding their own very yeah. well. I love how they subverted expectations in the beginning where it's like you see the numbers and you're like, there's no way. But then you see yeah. them using strategy and you're like, okay. You won't have an army if you don't fall back! Back to the ship! Yeah. Their turn to lose today. I hope this demoralizes them a little bit. <laughs> yeah. They lost quite a few. Yes. They're literally chasing them off. Yep. Oh, no, this ain't over. Not yet. <laughs> Come back here. <laughs> Get your ass back here. <laughs> wow. wow. Oh my god. Watch them run away like that. Send an emissary to the Greeks. Tell them they can collect that dad. But they have done the same for us. It doesn't matter. He's the bigger wow. person. Wow. He really is honorable, isn't he? Yeah. Both him and Achilles, I do respect. Like, they both yeah. have that respect, you know, for what this all means. Oh, that was a phenomenal battle sequence, man. Dude, the pacing was... of it and how long it was. Yeah, it... it felt so rich. I feel like we got to see so many different... Because certain war scenes can feel generic after a mm -hmm. while, right? But the, this didn't feel like that at all. There it were storytelling like... beats within the, the fight itself. The men believe we came here for Menelaus' wife. Won't be needing her anymore. You insult him! It's no insult to say a dead man is dead. <laughs> right. <laughs> Your private battle with Achilles is destroying us. Achilles <laughs> is one man! Hector is one man. Mm-hmm. Look what he did to us today. I don't care about the man's allegiance. I care about his ability to win battles. Yeah, yeah. of course. He's your best fighter. The men's morale is weak. Weak. They're ready to swim home. <laughs> <laughs> You'll want the girl back. You can have that damn girl. <laughs> Jesus. I haven't touched her. I gave her to the men. Oh, great. There's no way he's going to listen to you now. You won't be needing that for much longer. Hold her. <laughs> oh, no. Ooh. Ooh! Good for you! Uh, Damn! It's gonna get marked. Oh! Ooh. Nice! Once you fight them, you have courage. Fight back when people attack me. Dog has that kind of courage. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Feisty. Eat. 
it's interesting to see him care for her, right? Yeah. I've known men lacking my whole life. No, you haven't. <laughs> He's so cocky. Soldiers understand nothing but war. Peace confuses them. And you hate these soldiers. I pity them. Trojan soldiers died trying to protect you. Perhaps they deserve more than your pity. Mm. Wow. Got a point. Why did you choose to love a god? I think you'll find the romance one-sided. <laughs> <laughs> Do you enjoy provoking me? Yeah. Yes. I'll tell you a secret. The gods envy us. Mm. Because any moment might be our last. Everything's more beautiful because we're doomed. Mm. 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 It's valuable wow. because it doesn't last. It doesn't last forever. Forces you to cherish things more, right? I thought you were a dumb brute. <laughs> Could have forgiven a dumb brute. <laughs> I love that. Wow, what a great character. There's so much more to him. But even she says it, right? Like, she could have forgiven a dumb brute, but... Yeah. Oh, no way. Do it. Oh. Damn. Aren't you afraid? Everyone dies. Today or 50 years from now. He does not fear death. Wow. You'll kill more men if I don't kill you. Many. He does not back down. Oh, okay. that's how it is. <laughs> hey, I mean, yeah. She's like, that's not a one sided romance, I no, guess. Right? I guess not. This is definitely not it. I think it's great how they built it, though. It doesn't feel like it came out of nowhere. So many times it just feels like random. Yeah, like, like, why would she do this or whatever? Where did whatever. that come from? Yeah. My girl is out. There's not a single night he doesn't fight his battles. What a man. <laughs> it's like, you devious dog. <laughs> Her? Wow. Tell the men to start loading the ship. We're going home. Whoa. Whoa. We need you back. Greece needs you. Greece got along fine before I was born. The men need you. Yeah, you're the only one they can that can rile them up the way he does. Things are less simple today. Women have a way of complicating things. <laughs> Very <laughs> ironic to say when that's the cause of this war. Greeks are being slaughtered. We can't just sail away. You betray all of Greece just to see Agamemnon fall. Someone has to lose. Yeah, he believes in the fight. Still, yeah. he still believes that it's for Greece. Well, it's the naiveness of youth, right? And the lack of experience. The Myrmidons didn't fight yesterday. There must be dissension among the Greeks, but if we attack their ships, we will unify them. He's so smart. It's very smart. The Greeks underestimated us. We should not return the favor. Yeah, Thank you. That's very sensible yes. of him to say. Great strategist, man. This is awesome. The gods have cursed the Greeks. Two of their kings have already gone down to the dust. Prepare the army. We attack. No. They are going to unify. Please don't. Prepare the army. It's very tempting, right? Because they're they're hurt right now, right? Yeah. The animal is licking its wounds and mm -hmm. recuperating. This is the moment to strike. So I get yeah. it from a st strategic point of view. It makes right. perfect sense. Man, he's going to get caught in his sleep. Literally, with his pants down. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, stealth attack, oh, huh? Oh, shit. Yeah. Wow. I wonder if this is considered, like, honorable, wait, them attacking wait, wait. them in their sleep. Well, I don't know about honorable, but definitely uh, strategic as hell. Yeah. Because when you think about it, is it honorable to show up with, like, 10,000 men, more men than that, your opponent true, and win the true. battle? So. Oh, what is oh. that? Oh, Is that, like, hay? Oh, it's going to create balls of fire. <gasps> Oh, Holy that's so shit. smart! Yeah. Wow. Wow. So insane, the... <laughs> how smart and strategic they were back then. Wow. Damn. This looks fantastic. I'm loving the amount of practical effects in this movie. Yes! He, oh man, that look in his eyes. Yeah. He's just looking at all of this. He knows this is a big mistake. Yeah. <laughs> that is so badass. 
Wow. Yeah, showing some of their own numbers too. <laughs> wow. Yikes. I love the power dynamic and how it keeps swaying in this film. Yes. You know? They lose a battle, they win a battle, they lose a battle. Oh shit, Achilles is there? It's gonna help them out. Interesting. Look at how much they love him. He's gonna lift their spirits. Obviously, they feel safer when he's with them. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my god, it's battle after battle, man. Well, it did exactly what Hector said. Unite yeah. them. It united them. You're very right. Was that the Willem scream? I, I <laughs> was just thinking about that. I don't know. It sounded like it, right? Here we go, boys. Oh, no. It's a showdown. I don't want to see this. I like them both. I don't want to see this. Oh. That's insane. Oh. oh! Oh! What? Oh, wow. Holy, Holy shit. shit. I was not expecting him to die. Oh. Wait. No. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't think it was the cousin. I thought that was... I thought it was Achilles. Oh, the movie really made us think that was Achilles. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's just horrible. Yeah, to kill him. This is gonna be bad. That's the one person we've seen him care yeah. a lot for. Shit. Not for one day. Like, it feels like that, like that was his Paris, you know? Yeah. That was exactly, exactly that. Hector. I like that they both decided to stop. You violated my command. No, my lord. They didn't actually. I ordered the Mumadans to stand down. We led them into combat. I didn't lead them, my lord. We thought you did. Yeah, yeah. we all did. Holy yeah. shit. This movie looked, got us. He looks so much like him, the long blonde hair. Yeah, and you said it too. You're like, why would they, he didn't want to join them? Yeah. <sighs> Fuck. We thought he was you, my lord. He wore your armor. He even moved like you. Oh. <sighs> He's gonna lose his mind. Yeah. He's dead, my lord. Hector cut his throat. Ah, <sighs> dude. It's not his fault. Come on. Oh. Damn. Of course, because he trained him. Of course, he would move like Achilles. They right? got us good, man. Holy shit. They got me, man. I was like, for one second, I can't believe they killed Achilles like that. Do you remember how to get here? Yes. Yeah, protect oh, wow. your loved ones, because... Follow the tunnel. You follow the okay. river until you get to Mount Ida. The Greeks won't go that far inland. Wow. Why are you telling me this? You know why. Yeah, you know. If the Greeks get inside the walls, it's over. Yes. They'll kill all the men. They'll throw the babies from the city walls. And the women they'll take as slaves. And yes. that for you will be worse than dying. Yeah, you have to prepare yeah. for the worse. He has to prepare her. You save as many people as you can, but you get here and you run. Do you Shit. understand? Well, she's got her duty now. Protecting that kid and herself is priority. The boy today. And he was young. He was much too young. Damn, that's so impactful, right? To see him. He's a father. He now knows yeah. the weight. He wouldn't want his boy to go through that, you know, ever. Mm -hmm. And he you know, didn't he know. didn't want to. He yeah. didn't know. And he's doing this like out of duty. Because he has to. But man, that young boy that- That boy's just saved this war for us. <laughs> you fucking prick. The worst part is that he is right. Yes. Legolas. <laughs> yeah, he's taking that seriously. Yeah, no. he better have, you know, better aim than <laughs> swordsman <laughs> skills. Yes. Shout out to the costume design, man. These look beautiful. Looks they stunning. really do. And it's not just these two sets. I mean, we've been seeing hundreds of them throughout the yeah. entire movie. Oh, no. Hector's my cousin. He's a good man. Please don't fight him. Please. <sighs> Shit. 
damn it, you see what could have been too. And- I know, slipping away from you right there. I understand him though. I would be pissed too. Quiet before the storm. Yeah. Damn, it's just him. Ballsy. <laughs> Shit, what a move, just showing up to the front gates like that? No! Wow. He's too good. He's too honorable. No, he wouldn't. He would want to hear him out first, right? Hector! Hector! Oh my god, calling him out by his name. Wow. Hector! You f- you f hear the rage and the grief in his voice? All oh, the pain. I served you as best as I could. Oh, he knows he's dead. Wow. No father ever had a better son. Aww. Oh, man. So many fantastic performances in this. You're the best man I know. Oh, man. You're a prince of joy. I know you'll make me proud. Earn it, man. Yeah. He still has faith in him. Yeah. This is almost, I mean, it's heartbreaking. It is. But I love how the movie makes you root for both of them. Like, yeah. it's such a hard fight to watch now. Yes. This is gonna be horrible. I just- I just want them to stop. I really don't want to watch this. <laughs> oh man, that sucks. <laughs> he's still screaming. <laughs> he will- yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not backing from this. <laughs> This bitch. <laughs> yeah, he's like, it's all I your mean, damn fault. <laughs> Obviously, we know it's not. Nah, he's too nice for her that. fault, no. She must feel terribly. I'm so nervous, dude. <laughs> Here we go, man. The moment we've all been waiting for. I feel like the entire movie has been leading up to this, right? Can we just talk? <laughs> I'll make a pact with you. Let us pledge that the winner will allow the loser all the proper funeral rituals. There are no pacts between lions and men. <laughs> oh, he's mad mad. Yep. Now you know who you're fighting. <laughs> oh, shit. Dude, he's so- he's yeah. such a petty bitch and I'm here for it. I thought it was you I was fighting yesterday. You will wander the underworld blind, deaf, and dumb, and all the dead will know this is Hector. Fool who thought he killed Achilles. Yeah, he was already dangerous, but with all that Shit. anger. Yeah. Uh, I'm scared. Uh, I'm scared. Uh, oh, that's, oh yep, that's the move. Great form. <gasps> Oof. God damn. The choreograph wow. is great too. It's stunning. Shit. Oof. Ah. Oh wow. You gotta attack a little bit more, man. Don't stay on the defense. Oof. Nice. Okay, good job. There you good go. job. Ah. Ah. Fuck. <laughs> the good ringing job, of the swords, yeah. man. Oh, that's a great shot though. <gasps> <laughs> oh. Did you see that? That was amazing. Oh, that signature move didn't work this time. That's two times. Uh huh. Oh no! No 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 no! Please no! Please don't! Ah! Oh. Oof! Oh, he's lucky he oh, didn't break shit. his break his arm right there. I thought he was gonna. Get up! Won't let a stone take my glory. <laughs> Let a stone take my glory. What a great line. Wow. Nice. Oof. And the way they dodge. It's amazing, dude. Like the footwork, the form. They did fantastic, both of them. Oh, oh, oh. Holy shit. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, fuck. Damn. He fought bravely as well. Yeah. 
It was inevitable. I mean, yeah, yeah. Achilles, they, they build him up to be such a, an amazing yeah. fighter. It just. Oh, wow. He's going to disrespect him. Yes. Well, I mean, he said he was going to, right? Yeah, he's a man of his word. He is the main villain of the story. He does not deserve that, man. I understand going for the kill, but that's just yeah. a bit too much. Yeah. Damn. So much for your gods, huh? Somewhere Apollo's like, huh, huh? What, what happened? <laughs> oh, shit, I missed the fight again. Yeah, he's back. That only mean one means one thing. Damn, how the things changed so quickly. It's all this massive domino effect, really. Yeah, that's so true. You lost your cousin, now you've taken mine. When does it end? It never ends. <laughs> the fight never stops. What is this? Wait, no way. Oh, Whoa, what? what? How the hell? Wait, what? I kiss the hands of the man who killed my son. Holy shit. Yeah. Priam, how did you get in here? I know my own country better than the Greeks, I think. <laughs> well, you should have exploded that earlier, but... You're a brave man. You really think death frightens me now? Yeah, he doesn't yeah. care. Give him back to me. He deserves the honor of a proper burial, you know that. Wow. Yes, he, he does. came here for the body. Oh. You know he deserves better, man. He thought it was you. How many cousins have you killed? <laughs> yeah. I love my boy from the moment he opened his eyes till the moment you closed them. Wow, what a powerful line. Let me wash his body. Give him the body back, Jesus! Let me say the prayers. Let me place two coins on his eyes for the boatman. Come on, man. You had that right, too. Yeah. You allowed that. Yeah. If I let you walk out of here, you're still my enemy in the morning. He knows you're that. You're still my enemy tonight. <laughs> but even enemies can show respect. Exactly. Yeah. That is so true. Wow. The dialogue in this is incredible. His performance is heartbreaking. Yeah. Man. They're both doing an incredible job. What a fantastic scene. I admire your courage. Meet me outside in a moment. I hope he does yeah. what's right, man. We'll meet again soon, my brother. Wow. He's, yeah, he's such a complex character, yeah. man. It's incredible. That's a great reiteration of what he just said, right? That even enemies can have respect for each other. And he they did show, show it in the end. Your son was the best I fought. In my country, the funeral games last for 12 days. It is the same in my country. Then the prince will have that honor. Wow. No Greek will attack Troy for 12 days. Oh. <laughs> Perseus? Yeah, they probably didn't even know she was alive. I thought you were dead. Yeah. Is he gonna allow her to leave? If I hurt you, it's not what I wanted. Oh, that's a seashell necklace. Go. No one will stop you. You have my word. Damn, yeah, man. What well, could have been? Yeah. It that sucks. was a better king than the one leading this army. He is. What a great compliment, too. And it's true. He is a far better king than the one that they're fighting yeah. alongside with. Not even alongside with. He's just yeah. there. <laughs> he really is just there. Piece of shit. Wow. What a brave, brave man. He knew he was going to lose and he still fought. He knew he made all the preparations. Maybe he was hoping, but... I think the way they established them as fighters as well. Like, I wasn't sure if... Hector could match up, but I always had that feeling that Achilles was still better. For my son, back home. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Probably mm -hmm. one of the most famous moments in this particular yeah. history. Forgive me, Eudorus. You've been a loyal friend all your life. Mm. 
I hope I never disappoint you again. Aww. Rouse the men, you're taking them home. Aren't you coming with us? He doesn't even know. I have my own battle to fight. Then we march beside you. This is the last sword I give you. Wow. Damn, you can see the love these men have for each other, how yeah. much they care. Fighting for you has been my life's honor, my lord. And that's it. Like you said, there's so much respect there, so much adoration. Wow. That looks incredible. Oh. Ah, oh. oh, damn. Of course, it had to be huge, right? This is a gift. We should take it to the temple of Poseidon. I think we should burn it. Burn it, my prince. It's a gift to the gods. Ah, man, they should have. <laughs> oh, shit. Our beloved Prince Hector had sharp words for the gods. Oh, come on. I swear. Father, burn it. I don't want to see any more sons of Troy incur the gods' wrath. Man, that's going to be your downfall. All that damn. Will not watch another son die. He's going to take it. Of course, he's a believer. He's going to take it in. And faith is going to bite them in the ass. Yes, it really is. What a great way, man. Like you read about these things, but then again, seeing it and yeah. come alive this way. The horse looks spectacular. You think that prince had never died? You're the prince now. Make your brother proud. That's his duty now, right? Wow. They were just fucking hiding, man. Oh, oh. Yeah. They're just waiting. Holy shit, man. Jesus. And this, my friends, is how the TSA came to be. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Yeah, take advantage of that stealth for yeah. as much as they can. So much for the night guard, huh? <laughs> oh man. That's a terrible way to go in your sleep like that. Oh, excellent music. This is so good. They're returning the favor, I guess, right? Y'all snuck up on us in the night? We're gonna do the same. Exactly. Oh, that's great. Wow. Wow, what a shot. The cinematographer said, hold my beer. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Move! Jesus. I really hope Hector's wife got to those tunnels. I really hope so, man. At least collect as many people as she can. Let's try burn! Burn it! Come it alone! Oh, come on. This guy can't win. He cannot. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Where is she? Oh, he's looking for her? Wow. Oh, he's man. just there for her. They keep subverting our expectations I with know. this character. It's a long way, quick. Hurry, there's a tunnel. Wow, look at all the people. Okay, that's she good. She was able to save. That's good. Do you know how to use a sword? Yes. Wow. As long as it remains in the hands of a Trojan, our people have a future. Aww. Wow. How could you love me if I ran now? Please! We will be together again, in this world or the next. He found that bravery. Yeah, it's the right thing to do, man. Yeah, for his brother and for his people. Make him proud. The Bogan waits for us! <laughs> I yeah. say we make him wait a little longer! Yes. Yeah! Ain't going to sticks just yet. Not just yet. <laughs> Come on, okay, good job. Oh, Great. good some aim. Great, mate. Great aim. Someone kill this fucking guy. <laughs> Sheesh. Damn, I'm surprised Sean Bean is still alive <laughs> yeah, this far. <laughs> I into was the about movie. to crack the same joke. I'm like, he lasted longer than I expected. Wow, some incredible visuals. He's just looking around and everything is everything is falling. Let me guess. Of course. Oh my god. No. The children spare the innocents. Oh man. That asshole did not deserve the win. Too late for prayer, priestess. 
<laughs> oh shit, now this is gonna get interesting because Achilles is not. I want to taste what Achilles tasted. He is so repulsive. Achilles, give this man what he Please. deserves. Please. You're like the last hope I have right now. Okay, that's good timing you now. Be my oh. And the night. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, well, she handled it herself. Jesus. Yo, suck on that, bitch. Who's on his knees now? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. Oh, shit. Oh. oh, he went for it. Save your lady, man. Damn. No! Oh, no! Oh, shit. Oh, no. It Achilles heel! Achilles oh. heel. <laughs> oh, man. This is how he's going out? Oh, they make you root for everybody no! here. <sighs> Damn, he's still going. Yeah. Dude! I mean, he's great at hand to hand, but what are you going to do against a ranged weapon? No. <sighs> Damn, she lost it all. Damn, man. You you root for one, then the other. It's this constant pendulum swing. Like, oh, he's smelling her hair. That's so sad. I can't even blame Paris because... Of course not. That man slaughtered your brother. You gave me peace. <laughs> no. In a lifetime of war. We're saying it's come. Just wait a little. It's almost dead anyway. In a new. We must go. Yeah, stay safe because yeah. the siege is still ongoing. It's all right. Go. Damn, that's crazy that he didn't mm -hmm. die in battle like we all thought he would, yeah. right? I feel like a more glorious death would have been more appropriate. Hector and him maybe killing each other or like fatally wounding each other. That would have been. I, I mean, mean, I wish that's how it went, right? That would have been more poetic. But just it the whole Achilles, Achilles heel thing, damn. I mean, it makes sense that Paris would do it this way because this way nobody can see him fall. There is no glory in this. He's just by himself. So true. It's the worst punishment. <laughs> just the arrow and the heel. My brother. Wow. Oh, man. Wow, from the first time we see it, how pretty it was and how clean. Yeah. To just completely destroyed. Down to ash. Damn. You're saying goodbye to your home. And just like that, you become a refugee. Yeah. Let them say I lived in the time of Hector, breaker of horses. <laughs> Let them say I lived in the time of Achilles. Yeah, both great men. Wow. 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 Hey. Holy shit, that did not feel like a three hour movie. Dude. This went by so fast. This was so well paced. Cause you know, like sometimes it can be an issue when it's like the, the uncut version or like a director's cut. Sometimes there can be issues there. No issues at all. I'm I, like, I don't know what the theatrical release was like, Um, but this, like every single moment that we got in this was absolutely amazing. It I can't imagine fantastic. what exactly they cut from the theatrical cut. I don't know what you would cut from this. I think it's a, it's perfect. I think yes, it's a longer movie, but I don't feel like it's shows just how long it is. I feel like you need all that time to really connect with the character. Some yes. of those more intimate discussions, again, mm -hmm. they let you kind of simmer in the moment and get immersed. And that illusion really holds up. Like not yeah. for one second that I snap out of Troy. 
No, you know, not at all. Out of, out of these battles while I was watching this from the, you know, the very beginning, yeah. you're immersed in the drama, right? Because yeah. it's juicy. You're like, oh my God, you're sleeping <laughs> with his wife. Paris and the whole Helen of Troy situation. That was, I mean, already you're like, don't do it, man. But I know. It's like that thing, right? Where you want to change history. You wish you yeah. could. And you know, some of the details I, I I didn't quite remember, but I'm so glad I watched this to kind of brush it up. It's great how they took some of the liberties who tell the story where we didn't really quite have a, such a definite answer in the poems they went all the way with yeah. how they said you know how they gave the answers like no this is how it happened and it's such a fascinating topic you know getting to see the story come to life really right. and and seeing it become a reality because they did it at, at such a big scale at no point did it feel like you know like you're watching a movie normally we're so focused on the things that make a movie a movie but i have to say this movie did a really good job at just keeping us immersed in this world and just ponder the question as to how it went down if it right. went down right we don't all, right yeah we still don't know they're pretty certain at this point that troy did exist right it's uh where modern day turkey is now and shout out to turkey but it's interesting that i think it's fair to assume that the iliad which is what this is based on it might also just be like a conglomerate mm, of tales right? of, of different tales. battles and whatnot yeah and just kind of stringing together many events and put it into one single poem uh regardless of that fact i i really really enjoyed the writing in this the, oh, the, yeah. the dialogue it was so witty it was it was smart it felt so real and there were like some of the clapbacks in this the, oh, the yeah. sass in this and it's so wonderful to see how fleshed out each character was they were strong characters too you know Very Brad strong. Pitt did an excellent job with Achilles uh, Eric Bana did an, an amazing an amazing job an amazing performance as well as uh, Hector yeah. and they both are two men who you admire because they're yeah. they're brave you know one wants the glory and you know he's brave and the other one cares for the for his people and yeah. understands that you know maybe war is not the answer at the moment and he doesn't want to get into that whole can of worms such a tragic story to have this guy dragging his feet and because of his brother's mistake yeah. and other people's blindsidedness with the whole faith and the god situation mm -hmm. how he ends up in this situation where he has to fight and not only he has to fight he has to fight the one guy that we all know could beat him because yes. I mean, it's Achilles, right? Man, it, it was such an incredible journey because even though we knew where this was all leading up to mm -hmm. uh, the the 1v1 with them two or the actual Trojan horse, which is the, the right. climatic point of the film that we've all been waiting for. Yeah. We've heard the story in the legends and yeah. we want to see that. I think the movie did such a great job at making us feel excited for those fights. But then when they actually happen, you feel the <laughs> consequence. You're like, shit, man, I don't want to see this. I know yeah. how this ends. This is going to be a tough watch. And I love that. I love that a film can make you forget about how things went down or, or what the ending of the story is while you're watching it and have a different perspective because I did feel like it, it provided uh, somewhat of a different take to make us, like you said, relate to the different POVs. You know, there's not a clear villain in terms of, you know, Achilles and, and Hector. They both have their reasons and they're both strong goals. So you root for both of them and you see how complex both of these characters are. The only one that you really hate is is the king, right? Yeah. Agamemnon and Menelaus, I think they're like the main antagonists I would proclaim because I feel like both Achilles and Hector I are almost like they're victims of circumstance at this point. Mm. They're kind of dragged into these battles and they both try to make the most of it for their own purposes, right? Whether it's more quote unquote selfishly like for Achilles where he wants to be remembered and he will do anything to be remembered or for Hector where it, he is trying to be the protector of his country. It's very difficult to do such a great job at establishing the POVs and it's so fascinating because the screenplay was written by David Benioff and you see already the early risings right of mm -hmm. the talent of writing political things a complex story but still making sure that every character is heard and then you can make up your mind which obviously we saw in the earlier seasons of Game of Thrones yeah. right it's it's about establishing every character's point of view what their drive is what their goal is and that is so important you see it pay off in this because I could relate to both I could understand understand Hector wanting to protect his his wife and his son and his home and his father and his brother and the loyalty that he feels for that but also the resentment that Achilles feels mm -hmm. for kings that won't fight their own battles right they just sit back and let other men do the dirty work other men die for their own greed really and that was it was so interesting and I also really enjoyed like almost the uh, redemption arc that they wrote for Paris where yeah. he started off being so cowardly and in the end he he manages 
manages to avenge his brother. Yeah. No matter how much it breaks our hearts, it's like the entire movie, right? It's it's a build up towards two events, I feel like. It's the duel between Achilles and Hector, but also the Trojan horse. That infiltration, siege, that plan, yeah. that siege. Brutal. Brutal, Holy man. Shit. And, the, and the way they realize that when you see the scale of that horse, it's both mesmerizing <laughs> mm -hmm. and horrifying at the same time because you know what it means. You see that yeah. horse and you're like, I can't believe there's like 50 guys in that horse I know. like or however many there were. I don't know. But you're like, there's people in there. Yes. And how the hell, like, you wish that somebody would have just peeked their head I in know, and, it and just... seen it. And when they're talking about it, they have fun with it, too, because they're like, oh, we should just burn it. You're like, yes. Please you should. burn it. You should just burn it. And, uh, you know, of course, that's not how things go down. But it, it's great that, you know, you get to feel that that struggle, that push yeah. and pull. The story moves in and it has this incredible ebb and flow where I feel I honestly feel and I don't say this about many movies that are this length. I always think, OK, I don't mind long movies, by the way, but I mm -hmm. always think there's places where you can tighten it up. For this movie, I think it really benefited from the the, the three hour <laughs> hour, yes. you know, the three hour runtime, mm -hmm. because I feel like we get to spend so much time with these characters that we get to understand them and we become attached to them. We understand their goals, their objectives, why they're doing what they're doing. And I feel like that's very important when you're telling a story about multiple POVs. Mm. And this this really nailed it. It's, it's a really hard mm. script to nail. And I think the guy did a phenomenal job. And, you yes. know, I understand that they took some liberties. So for those that are more of, you know, the poems purist out there, yeah. <laughs> I'm sure not everybody's absolutely content with every single decision. But I think as to date, this has to be one of the greatest epics I've seen in terms of scale. Yes. I mean, just the sheer, the cinematography aspect, right. just the sheer scale of things with mm -hmm. those wide shots. When they're talking about thousands of ships, you're like, oh yeah, thousands of ships. Mm -hmm. And then when you yeah. see it, you're like, holy shit. <laughs> that's a thousand that's a, ships. That's thousands and thousands <laughs> of ships. He wasn't lying, right? And when you see it, you, you realize just how massive these battles were. Mm -hmm. If they happened, you if know, happened. that's still up in the up Allegedly. In the air. From what I've read, they uh, found some clues that suggested that the battles, some of the battles at least did happen. But again, mm -hmm. we don't know. We can't really separate. It's curious how history is um, can get blurry sometimes, right? Yeah. When it's so long ago, there's a lot of documented stuff out there. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it's still a very large gray area where, you know, we don't know. But man, I think the trans Translation here was done pretty well. The whole yeah. Achilles heel moment. Mm -hmm. ah. <laughs> like at first you kind of hate him when you know when he's killing Hector you feel bad for Hector obviously but then when yeah. he dies you know he just wanted to save his girl there and yeah. he wanted nothing to do with what was going on I feel bad for Briseis because she lost everybody man she lost yeah. her her cousin she lost Achilles like mm -hmm. everybody that she really cared for yeah. at least she has um Paris I guess <laughs> and she got to survive and find another place and I love the whole sort of Troy and how yeah. that's passed down what an incredible incredible story I would give compliments to the music but like the the soundtrack that we got i don't think it was right. uh written for this movie still amazing soundtrack yeah because we were looking into it because we both really appreciated the score but it looks like the initial cut you know the, the score was not received too well um and then james horner was brought along and there were also some elements i think from uh, danny elfman's work that mm -hmm. was used into this regardless of that fact it did feel seamless obviously we didn't see the theatrical cut so i don't know if there is like a dramatic change between the theatrical cut and the director's cut uh, if you guys know please leave it in the comments but from this i i really really enjoyed it it was haunting it was beautiful and it felt very very unique you know you could feel almost like middle eastern hints here and there and i i, I really appreciate that they use some of those elements for the soundtrack it was i i thought it went perfectly along with the movie i couldn't tell honestly that it was yeah. out of place or reutilized music from a different film i'm sure that for those of you who've watched the other films of where they kind of borrowed some of the music you guys are like that sounds familiar, like the whole gladiator thing. And yeah. uh, apparently them using some, uh, you know, a theme that sort of resembles Pirates of the Caribbean. You'll see mm -hmm. that whenever we watch those movies. But yes. yeah, there's a theme there that kind of <laughs> resembles. But yeah, it's very interesting. I thought that, uh, I mean, uh, overall, it was very seamless. It didn't really affect my movie experience. No. This movie kept me immersed throughout. Great performances by everybody involved. Great script, great writing, great yeah. dialogue and great delivery, man. The way these people were saying some of these lines really... <laughs> Oh, really? <laughs> they were like punchlines. Every, yeah. every you know, other beat that they were having an intimate yeah. dialogue or there was only two people on the screen. They really managed to let these actors shine. Like these yeah. guys did fantastic. And then the fight choreography. Oh my God. Okay. The fight choreography and the sound design behind that, the the way you could like hear the armor shift, the way you could hear the, the swings of the sword. Yeah. And it just, it just made you feel how sharp those swords were, right? And the shield itself, you can feel that... It, 
it was heavy and that that is just absolutely stunning and i have to give kudos to the choreography in particular for the duel between hector and achilles oh that was fantastic it was amazing and again i don't know the how much they use stuntmen but whether it's the actual actors or just or stuntmen taking over at certain points, it was fantastic. I love that you saw different fighting styles. Mm -hmm. Like the, it was unique enough for you to really be able to discern how they exactly approach an attack or if they're more defensive and how exactly that works. And it was just such a stunning moment. It like I was holding my breath the entire time. I mean, this movie really had to nail that one duel. You're yes. there's an expectation that's being built. There's a tension and, you know, throughout the entire movie, you're like, what's going to happen when these two go 1v1? You know, when they mm -hmm. finally get that confrontation and you get that fake out with his cousin dying, uh, um, Achilles' cousin yeah. dying. And that moment was like, whoa. And there's like, wait, it's not him. That was such a great moment. That was a great They got twist. us good. They got us real good. So by the time that you're waiting for that, the actual duel, there's a certain level of expectation. I think they did a great job at the visual storytelling of the actual fight. The choreographer understood how to visually show us who these people are through their fighting skills and through their mm -hmm. fighting pace. You know, Achilles mm -hmm. is very confident. He keeps mm -hmm. striking. Obviously, he's angry, so his yeah, pace is going to be much say. more aggressive and and Hector is a bit more reserved he waits for the right time to strike you know mm -hmm. he tries to take advantage of whenever he sees those openings he's a bit more of a tactician in that sense yeah and I love that the you know the fight sequence really showed us just how different these two men are based mm -hmm. on how they act when they're in the middle of combat yeah another thing that I thought was just so worthy of appreciation is with the larger battle moments how they've managed to scale so many extras so many people yeah and at no point did it ever feel chaotic in the sense that it wasn't planned thoroughly. It was chaotic in the way that it was meant to. It, there was never like a moment where I saw like an extra in the background, like tripping over himself over thin air or anything like that. It felt like every single actor there and stunt person there had something to do. And that level of precision and that level of planning is absolutely incredible and something that, you know, every epic should strive for. Uh, that was a phenomenal, phenomenal film. Now I yeah. kind of feel weird. I'm, I'm back in my boring life here in modern society. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to go back to Troy. That was yeah. awesome. That was such a great that movie, was guys. Awesome. Thank you so much for suggesting this movie and for making sure that we watch the director's cut. We hope yes. that you guys enjoy. And as always, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. See ya.